This video is about Johannes Brahms' Haydn variations. I will explain the most important things about the work and the composer. Johannes Brahms was born in Hamburg in 1833. He was an important composer of the Romantic period and wrote symphonies, piano works and chamber music. Brahms lived in Vienna for many years, where he worked as a conductor and pianist. His music combines classical forms with romantic melodies. Johannes Brahms died in Vienna in 1897. The Haydn Variations were written in 1873, when Brahms was already a well-known composer. He came across a theme from an old brass chorale that was wrongly attributed to Joseph Haydn at the time. This theme inspired Brahms to write a series of variations. The premiere took place in 1873, conducted by Brahms himself. The work quickly became popular. The Haydn variations consist of a theme and eight variations. The theme is a simple chorale with a clear melody. Each variation changes the theme in a new and creative way. After the eight variations, there is a final finale. The work lasts about 20 minutes in total. The theme of the Haydn variations is based on a wind choral known as the Choral Saint Anthony. It has a calm and festive melody, which is introduced by the winds. The choral is accompanied by gentle strings. The theme consists of two parts, each of which is repeated. It forms the basis for the following variations. The variations change the theme in different ways. The first variation adds fast string runs. The second variation is slower and more melancholy. The third variation uses a rhythmically emphasized motif. Each variation has its own character and style. This keeps the work varied and exciting. The finale of the Haydn variations is based on a passicalia, a form in which a theme is repeated over and over again. The theme is played by the basses, while the other instruments play various melodies over it. In the course of the finale, the theme is developed in several variations. At the end, the theme is played triumphantly by the full orchestra. Although the theme of the Haydn variations is not by Joseph Haydn, Brahms had great respect for this composer. Haydn was one of the classical masters that Brahms admired. Brahms often drew inspiration from the clear, simple melodies and structure of Haydn's works. The Haydn variations are an example of this inspiration. The Haydn variations are an important work in Brahms's oeuvre. They combine classical forms with romantic expressiveness. The work shows Brahms's ability to vary a simple theme in many different ways. It is often performed in concerts today and remains a popular orchestral work. The Haydn Variations are an example of Brahms's musical creativity. Johannes Brahms had a strong influence on 19th-century music. His symphonies and piano works are considered masterpieces of the Romantic period. Brahms combined classical forms with new musical ideas. Many composers after him, such as Gustav Mahler and Arnold Schoenberg, admired his work. Brahms' music remains an important part of the classical repertoire. 